Hi right, guys and welcome to Visual C++ tutorial of an hotel management system. Now let me show you guys how this works. Here we have a data grid view that shows the names and details of the customer in the hotel. Supposing we want to search the system, let's just search for maybe Henry. Let's click on search. There we go. We have two Henrys in the hotel. And as you can see, this seems to be a duplication. However, let me just show you guys one thing. We can refresh and just get back to the whole system. We can exit, go, reset, and we can also select to populate any of the text box and all the necessary information that are stored on the data grid view. If we want to save this system, or save these details here the system is going to you see that it's a duplicate undo that okay earlier on you guys noticed we do have a duplicate copy of Henry that's Henry there and that's Henry here as well it's either we update that or we delete that extra record of Henry so let's click on delete there we go Henry's details, second details is all gone. And if we look into or if we look at our database and let's refresh that, we should be able to. Henry second details should be out of the system now. That is it right here. We have one and two. So all I'm just going to do is I'm going to refresh that. So let's just come in here and just kind of like refresh it. I'm going to open that again. The second details of Henry should be out, out of the system now. Look at that. That's Henry there. And that is it gone. Okay, let's scroll right down. The last record we have in here is that of Femi. So I'm going to minimize that. Right here, I'm going to add some more details. So let's come in here and just enter some details in there so let's go for so let's say it's seven 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 three seven there that's the reference number and the name of this guy i'm just going to call him kingsley kingsley queen an address of mr queen let's say is number 27 warwick avenue london postcode and mobile number the email address I'm just gonna say kings at gmail dot com nationality is British date of birth we make something up for him okay that's fine all right in here mail ID type passport and when was in your town that is automatically calculated right here well, let's assume is up to 16 and that becomes 13 meal breakfast and is in single room room number that's the room number and that's the room extension so all we just need to do now is take a good look at this last column here we'll click on total there we go that is Kinsley's details right there and that is also saved straight into the database if we go straight to the database and refresh that we should be able to see Kinsley's details right here so I'm gonna kind of like open up and just come back in there again and we should be able to see Kinsley details right at the bottom scroll down there there we go look at Kingsley's details okay in the database itself all right so the only thing we can do is supposing we want to amend anything like in here we seems to have we have captain Paul captain Paul here and another captain Paul here we can select it this way or that way if we click in here the system will this complaint will come out but you have to select this way 
So let's select one of the captain poles and I'm just going to change the details of this very captain pole. Let's say it is Captain Tommy. Yeah, Captain Tommy Johnson. So we just need to change his details. I'm going to change that. So let's say he leaves number 13 goes house and the postcode there. Let's change that to Tommy. And in here, I'm going to change this as well. But no, that's fine because that's a unique one. And oh, telephone number that is changed. Okay, the, the rest remain the same. So, all we then need to do is just to update. Okay, look at the ID number. So, just click on update. And that is it. Tommy's details is now updated. As you can see, there we go. Like I said, this is just an overview. So, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to take you guys straight into Visual C development environment and we put one of these together, guys. So let's do that now.